Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Fight Night Champion Legacy Mode. Fight Night Champion Legacy Mode. In the last episode, in the last video, the number one request you guys had for me was upgrade your chin, Marshall. Upgrade your chin. And you know what my response to that is? No. No, I won't do it. And this is not me saying I'm not going to listen to what you guys want. This is me saying... I know what you guys really want. You're saying upgrade your chin, upgrade your chin, but I guarantee if I do that, not only will I not lose a fight, I won't be rocked, the fight will not be interesting, the fights won't the fights won't be fun or entertaining, and a lot of you will simply lose interest. So I'm gonna leave it as it is. And I will upgrade my fighter, but I will not upgrade the chin. Just just don't worry, I know exactly what I'm doing. It's gonna be fine. So Anyways, my manager sent me a message. He says, Alan Scott got hurt during his training camp for his upcoming fight against Can Basilio. Do you want to step in? You won't get a lot of training time, but there's a big cash bonus. Yeah, let's do it. Why not? Let's do it. As you can see right there, that is literally, that's actually getting me closer to that title shot. We're going to make 37500 in that, in this particular fight. So let's go right ahead and do it. Um... I've got quite a bit of cash. I mean, 97 grand. <laughs> you know what? Let's go to Big Bear. Uh, yeah, let's let's go to Big Bear. We have not gone to Big Bear yet. We've gone to Mexico. We've, we've trained all over the world. Let's take the fight to where I'm going to develop a lot better. So we're going to train. Probably going to be uh, able to train once. Once we're done training, we're going to jump right into the fight. And then we are going to see how that actually fares now before i jump into the fight i'm going to upgrade my fighter and what i'm i intend to upgrade now my focus is going to be on my block as well as my head movement i want to leave the chin as the chin is you know what the problem is is not is not the chin the chin is realistic it's the block it's the block my block is getting broken too easily and um oh wow shit okay let's do it my block is getting broken a lot a lot easier than it should, and I'm not able to sway as fast as I want to be able to sway, as well as lean as far as I want to be able to lean. So once I upgrade my block, and once I upgrade that head movement, things are going to be fine. I'm going to be fine. I won't be getting rocked as much as I'm getting rocked, but even, even if I'm getting rocked, I like it. I find it interesting. It makes the, the, you know, the fights more competitive in my eyes. You know, I'm not just feeling like I can just run through the AI easy, so. Okay. Alright. The block and the head movement. Back up, baby. I've got a guy that's throwing quite a bit of straights here and there. Yep, a lot of power straights. Let's go. All right. I think I got it here. I know the shots I'm going to try to land on this dude. All right, we got the 30. Let's go, baby. Come on. Now he's not throwing. <laughs> Alright, rip him. There we go. Caught me with, with the straight right there. Beautiful. Got to 40,000. Beautiful. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Straight. Forty-three thousand here. Forty-six. All right, we're doing good. Doing good. It's almost over. Actually, got enough enough XP here. Let's look at this. Okay. All right. Advance. Let's go ahead and advance. I'm going to. Hmm. Let's see. Okay. 
Let's train one more time. This time I'm going to do athletic training. I'm going to improve my strength a little bit. Okay. Free weights. All right, now we're going to rest. Rest, get back 80% stamina, and then we're going to jump into this fight. Let's go ahead and rest here. Before I jump into the fight, I'm going to upgrade my uh, my boxer. Let's go to boxer growth. Let's let's do let's put some upgrades on that block. Yeah, I'm not touching the chin. Blocking right there. Beautiful. Let's leave it right there. And let's let's get into this fight, ladies and gentlemen. Things are slowly but surely looking up. I'm also going to upgrade my heart a little bit. Like, I don't want to not be rocked. I want I want to be able to be rocked. But I do want to be able to recover. And I have to upgrade the jab as well. I throw the jab quite a bit, so I need to upgrade that jab. I'm going to try to upgrade my left hook as well. But it's all right. We're going to get there. My fighter is still growing. We're still in the in the early stages of the career. Things are going to improve. Anyways, once I get into the fight, I'll be right back with you guys. Mexico City Plaza. Mexico City Plaza. Let's do it. Another short opponent that I am pretty sure is powerful as hell. Yep, I can feel it already. This guy's got power. That's a guy that I'm not going to brawl with. Just move around. You got a full caught him with the straight. Make sure that I am using good movement here. Okay. Because he's not going to be overly aggressive either. Straight. Caught him with that left hook. Double up that jab. Trying to hit him with that left hook while he's leaning. Okay. Throwing some leather at this dude. Just like that. Just like that. Caught him. He's hurt. Yep, dropped him right there. Beautiful. Bang, bam. Put him on his back. All right, he's going to get right back up, and we're going to try to drop him again. Let's see if I can end this in the first round. I might be able to end it in the first round if he does not go into a massive defensive shell. Okay. Yep, he's he's slowly going into a defensive shell now. Stop. That's what I expected. Okay, let's push him. Okay. Drop them again. Woo. Oh boy. Dropped them again in the first round. He might actually have been saved by the bell right there. They might not even give him the count. Okay, he got the count. Oh, see what I mean? Yeah. If you get dropped so close to the end of the round like that, you make it into the second round. So, lucky him. Lucky him. Man, this dude is getting ripped. Oh. Ripping it. Uppercut. Double jab. Bam, bam, bam. I need to get this dude out of here early. Right there. He's dropped again. He's dropped again. Uppercut. Left hook. Left hook. Right hook. Missed. He ain't getting up. He's not getting up. 
or will he? Is he going to get up? Tough son of a bitch. Wow, he is tough as nails. Okay. Oh, oh, mm, mm. okay. Right there. Go to the body, 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 head. Body, head, head, body. Right there. Fight is, fight is over. He's not getting up. He's not getting up. That was just nasty. Right hook, left hook, right hook. He has dropped. He's not getting up. He's done. He's done. And I took this fight on short notice, too. Come on, big guy. Oh, he's done. All righty. That one was a success. We might even be able to get three fights in this episode. We'll see. We shall see. Hopefully, the next fight I do, I'm able to finish just as fast. Look at him. That's it. Fight is over, ladies and gentlemen. Let's move on. Let's move on. 10-7 round. That's just crazy. Oh, my God. That is just crazy. I was able to just blast through his block so easily. He barely landed anything to my head. Okay. We, uh... <laughs> We, we completed all the challenges, knock him down by round three, knock him out in under six rounds, win with less than 11% damage. So we, we did it. Let's try to keep this, this nice, beautiful streak going. So far, I've got 11 wins, seven knockouts. Nice. Nice. Let's proceed. Let's look at the message, whatever my ma my manager is sending. Fight challenges, what a streak. He's about to offer me a fight, isn't he? How many wins is that? You're hot in the ring right now, nobody can touch you, but Dominic Murray wants to find that out the hard way. You want to put this clown to the mat or what? Sure, why not? One of you already has a fight schedule. Check your messages often to avoid missing events and challenges. What? What are you talking about? One of us already have, has a fight scheduled. I'm number... Dude, I'm number 16. I just fought this guy. Why are you offering me to fight him again? Hold on a second. doesn't even make any sense see what I mean like I just fought this guy they, they won't allow me to accept this fight against Dominic it says one of you already has a fight scheduled check your messages often to avoid missing events and challenges I don't see I don't see any fight scheduled for me And that's the next guy in line. I guess we're going to have to beat him up again. He's going to have to beat him up again. Go to Puerto Rico. Let's, let's do some training here. We're just going to have to beat that dude up again. You know what? This time, I'm not going to show you guys the, the sparring. It's basically the same exact fight. So I'm going to do the training. And I will be right back with you guys once the second fight starts off again. Alrighty, welcome back. Welcome back to the next fight. Same guy that we just whooped. We're gonna have to beat, his, beat him up again. And it sucks for him. It sucks for him. But he's gonna get destroyed again. Ripping his body now. Right there. Ooh. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. This dude. Oh, 
Oh, dropped. Oh boy. I mean, this dude is just getting completely obliterated, man. He's not gonna be able to withstand this. He's not gonna be able to withstand this. I mean, why do they want me to beat him up twice? Ugh. Homeboy is hugging now. He has to. I mean, it's like I'm just ripping his body repeatedly over and over. He's moving his head well, but it's just not gonna be enough. Moving his head, trying to hug. Like, just pushing him backwards. Ugh. Like, it's just... Come on. Come on. Dropped. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, dude, I'm just... Just trying to break through his block with a barrage of punches. Just... Repeatedly, over and over and over and over. Is he gonna get right back up? Is he gonna get back up? He's probably not gonna get back up. Again! Again! <laughs> like in the first fight, he gets saved by the bell. Well. Come on. Ah. Uh. Mm. Body, head, body, body, head, body, body, head, body, head, head. Fight is over. This dude's not getting up. I cannot imagine how he gets up. I mean, that is just, that's just, he just has no way of stopping this. He just has no, he's going to get back up. He looks like he's going to get back up. Nope, he's done. Oh, wow. Mm. Okay. Bye. He's done. God. He's just a punching bag for me, basically. He's just a punching bag for Roy Jones. Ugh. Brain damage. Dude's gonna get some, he's gonna get, man, oh my goodness, he's done, fight's over. Okay, do not do this to this poor guy again. Do not make me fight this guy again. I don't know what the hell is going on, but let's, let's, let's move on. Let's move on and see what my manager is going to offer up. Or at the very least, man, like, give me someone that's ranked higher than me. Stop, stop giving me fighters that I'm ranked higher than, that makes no sense. Trying to get to that belt, trying to get to that title. So this is the second fight we've done for this video. I'm going to try to see if I can get one more fight. Hopefully this one is going to be against a different opponent. Okay, so we've got a message from Sparring Sessions. You can get bonus XP from Sparring Events. So why did you ignore the last event? It's too late now, but look for these next... What? What are you talking about? Oh, okay. Hey, we have a sponsor sponsorship opportunity. I know it's pretty exciting, but don't let it get to your head. There are much better deals in store if you keep rising up the ranks. Anyway, it'll be money in the bank. Just don't change any of your gear up before the fight. Here are the details. So my robes, two fights, cash, 2,000. That works. Let's edit the boxer. Let's do it. Okay, so next up, we're going to schedule a fight. Schedule a fight. Beautiful. <laughs> we are ranked 15. I could fight that dude. That's a fighter that I created a while back. Let's go ahead and fight Walters. Let's keep moving up the ranks. Let's keep moving up the ranks. What's next? I need to increase my toughness. Mm. 
England. You want to go to Mexico? Kind of want to go to Mexico. Let's see. No, let's go to Detroit. <laughs> let's go to Detroit. One of you made fun of me for trying to go to Detroit to train in one of the videos. It was hilarious. I don't remember what you said, but it was it was quite hilarious. But we'll go to Detroit. Not my uh, my number one place to visit. Absolutely not. But uh, I'm trying to improve my strength, my speed, as well as condition. And I believe those were the three three uh, skills we're going to be improving here. So let's go to Detroit and let us train. Hold on, let me look at this. Promo event for Rival. You got it, let's accept. Let's do it. Yeah, let's try to go to these events. Um, I'm not gonna show you guys the training. I'm not gonna show you the sparring, or should I? Should I? Should I show you the sparring? Yeah, why not? Why not? I'm gonna show you guys the sparring session. Let's get an idea of the opponent we're about to face next. I mean, we'll keep facing these guys that are much smaller. Now we're facing a guy that's 5'7". He's about to face Roy Jones. Let's get an idea of what his fight temp temp template. Can't freaking talk. His fight template. Let's find out what it's like. He's probably going... Okay, so he's a southpaw. That's not That's not good. He's a southpaw and a aggressive, okay? Aggressive southpaw. Those guys can be a pain in the butt. The good thing, though, he's going to leave himself wide open. A lot of these exchanges, let me switch to Southpaw myself. Okay. Look at how many straight lefts he, he just threw. Like he threw three in a row. Okay. He's getting ripped. Fighter is slow. What the hell is going on? Work it, work it. Let's go. Come on, baby. Do something. Let's go. Nice. Nice. Okay. Oh, keep your feet moving. I'm actually gonna get to 20. Get off me. Sparring these southpaws are a pain in the ass. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 26, 27. Come on, 30. 30. There we go. Oh no. Let's keep 30. Thirty-one. Okay, you can hug me for the rest of this, for the rest of the round there. Okay, so we are pretty good. Um, next up is going to be an event, I believe. Yes, next up is an event. We're gonna go to the event right now. Absolutely. Let's try to get those big name fights. Congratulations, you have completed this event and improved your popularity. Thank you. What's next? Let's rest. Should I? Sure, why not? Beautiful, okay. Next up, I'm going to improve my boxer. Let's go and do just that. Combinations I would like to improve, for sure. Combinations. Blocking head movement. I like blocking. Bam. Okay. Let's get the block up right there. Exactly where I wanted to be. Eh. So far, man. Like, I'm I'm able to land the jab. It's like 
my jab, I feel, is fast enough. I'm able to land it pretty effectively. What I need is to be able to throw faster combinations. I need my block on point, and I need my straight right. Everything else is going to work itself out. You know, again, I know you guys were requesting that I upgrade my chin. Uh, you want me to upgrade the chin, but I feel like you're asking for something that you're not really going to like if I if I go ahead and do it. Um, I don't feel like I'm going to get rocked too much, especially if the opponent is hitting my block. If I do get rocked, it's going to be actual counters. It's going to be intercept shots that should cause a rock. So um, that's what I'm excited about. My block is good. I should be good to go. The more I improve my block, a lot of these shots won't be getting through the block like they used to. So that should that should be good. Let's jump into the fight right away. Immediately. He's not a southpaw. Thought he was a southpaw. Immediately this dude is getting ripped. I feel the power difference. Oh god. I feel for this dude. I feel for him. Oh god, he has no idea what he's in for. See that? The jabs, the jabs are good. Oh, poor fella. All right. Beautiful. Rip the body a little bit there. Jab. Long jabs, just ripping shots. Almost caught him with that beautiful left hook. Uppercut. Trying to see if I can hit him with that left hook. Oh, caught me. Beautiful. Left hook, left straight. Right there, left straight. Beautiful. Don't get finished. Dropped. Mm -mm -mm. These guys are get man, they are getting molly walked right now, dude. These guys are getting destroyed, man. They are getting destroyed. I'm starting to feel I'm starting to feel invincible a little bit. But no, I'm not gonna get overconfident. I'm not gonna let myself get overconfident. Cannot underestimate the opponent. Yep, exactly, exactly. Caught me in the transitions. I like that rock. I like rocks like that. What I don't want is to be getting rocked through my block. But if you catch me in between a transition, hold on, I wanna see that. Hold on a sec. Where, where is that? Right there. It wasn't in between a transition, it was in between a, a punch. Hold on, let me move this camera in. All right, let's watch that. Caught him with that. I try to throw another straight. I believe I try to throw another straight. Right there. No, it was a left hook. I was going to throw a shot, and he placed one right there. Beautiful. I like that. That's the kind of rock I want to get. That's a realistic rock, and that's why I'm leaving my chin as low as it is. If I if I increase the chin, I'm not gonna be getting rocked when I throw reckless shots like that. So that's good. That's good. All right. Let's try to stay behind the jab, unless there's a clean opening. Again. 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 Okay, I think I know Homeboy is dangerous in between those punches. Hold on a second. Let me show you guys again Where is it right there? Where is it? Okay, so watch that that was over the jab over the jab BAM <laughs> God, I wish EA UFC was like that. Okay, let's relax a little bit. Let's relax. One thing's for certain. He's not he's not rocking me through the block. Alright. 
Beautiful. Caught him right there. I love the way he just immediately started tuning me up. See what I meant, man? I was underestimating him a little bit. Feeling invisible and shit. I shouldn't. Alright. He's gonna get KO'd though. That's for a fact. He's being a lot more careful now. Beautiful. Come on. Yeah, careful with that straight. Careful with that straight over the jab. Right there. Caught him. Caught him coming in. He's gonna try to... Left, left hook, right straight. Okay. In this third round, I'm gonna stand my ground a little bit. In the third round, I'm gonna stand my ground. Okay. Let's stand. Let's stand my ground just a little bit and see if I can push this dude backwards. My block is good. Right there. Oh yeah. Don't want to get caught in between punches like that. up all right missed I'm good I'm good I'm good all right He's ripping. Okay, so now we're pushing. Come on, baby. Okay. Look at him, backing up, trying to recover. Doing a good job of it. All right. We have him in a defensive shell right now. Let's push. A lot smarter than the other guy. But that's done. Mm. Oh, 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 oh. Bam. Dude, when I get my combinations up, oh my goodness, man. When I get the combinations where I need to get the combinations, the punches will fly at these the punches will fly at them in with so much speed, they're not gonna they're not gonna know where it's coming from. They will they will have no clue where it's coming from, and that dude's done. He's done. He's done. Man, he landed some beautiful intercept intercepting shots there. Intercepted a a, a left uppercut. Intercepted a jab with a straight. Some good intercepts there and was able to rock me twice. But um, of course, we got them out of there. And I am going to end this one right here, people. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comment section what you thought about the episode. The next episode will be coming at you very, very shortly. As always, have a wonderful day and keep yourself safe.